Hey everyone, I'm Harley and it's really nice to see you on our channel. First of all, please subscribe and thumbs up and let us begin this video. In this video, we're going to talk about how to promote your WordPress plugin with 16 very simple steps. And if you're ready, let's start right away. So the main steps, let's start with the first one, which is on-site and off-site promotion. Basically, what is on-site promotion? On-site promotion of your plugin, you can do it by having a blog. For example, let's say you have some sort of gallery plugin, you can have a blog on your website where you post about other gallery plugins, where you tell about your product, where you compare gallery plugins together and where you generally talk about how users can create a good visuals for their website. Thus, you can generate good content that will attract more visitors. And every article can have at the end a paragraph that is aimed to generate leads for your product. Another on-site promotional method is about having different pages on your website. And for example, one page can be dedicated to products you offer. Be that gallery plugin or any other sort of plugin, you should have a separate page where you show off the plugins you offer with the main features because users nowadays prefer easy user interface, they prefer everything organized. Therefore, make sure you can provide that. The second part of the first step is off-site promotional methods. How to promote your website off-site? Well, link building strategy is the best you can use. Find out emails and other websites that are close to your theme and try to connect with them, try to get back links, collaborate with them and also share about your product on social media, do lives, do interesting uh, challenges connected to your product, for example, who will create the best looking gallery portfolio, they will get a price, for example, this plugin for free and the premium version for a lifetime, I don't know. Come up with a creative price that will help you to increase conversions. The second step is basically very close to what I said before, it is about providing free trial or discount. Uh, basically, when you have a plugin, and especially if you are a new creator, users uh, do not have the trust factor towards you, therefore you need to prove yourself in a way. And if you only offer a premium version for the plugin, make sure to offer at least from 7 to 30 days free trial run period so that users can create something to test out your plugin, to understand how it all works and to decide do they really need it or no. What is the benefits of this method? Well, first of all, you will increase conversion rates because when users know they have access to a premium plugin for free, they will be more motivated to take it. Secondly, if they truly love the features, they will purchase the product. And thirdly, it will create more positive image towards your product or in a case if it has bugs, they will report it and it will be more of a beta testing. And during the holidays, do not forget to offer discounts because they truly work. Is it Christmas holiday? Is it some other big holiday? Easter or whatever? Just offer discounts and make sure to announce about it on all the platforms, on social media, on your YouTube channel, on your website. Another strategy to gain more clients uh, for your WordPress plugin is submit the free version of the plugin in uh, WordPress repository. How would you do that and why would you do that? Well, it is very easy actually to do and why would you do that? Because users, again, do not know who you are, probably do not know who you are and they need to trust you and if they see your plugin which offers great features and has a free version, they will download it, they will test it out, they will understand that they love it, they need the premium version and they will purchase the premium version. Also, in order to get more publicity, what else can you do? You can submit your plugin not only on WordPress repository, but also in other repositories, for example, such as Code Canyon or Envato Market. They work actually great, and there you can just submit the premium version. Remember the very first step I mentioned about on-site promotional strategies? Well, now let's focus particularly on blog and on videos. 
make sure to offer both type of content because some users prefer to watch videos, others prefer to see uh, written content and you can offer both. Yes, it will take some more effort and time, but at the end of the day, it will benefit you because I'm sure if you are watching this video, you really want to promote your product and you really believe on its success. So do not forget to try it out. Uh, you can create a YouTube channel where you can create lots of content connected to how to use your content, uh, how to use your plugin. Uh, another video is connected to gallery plugins, if it's a gallery plugin, because maybe it's a security plugin. Then, of course, dependent on your theme, uh, choose topics that are connected, because users need to see connections. And if you're offering, I don't know, security plugin, but posting about marketing strategies, that would be quite silly. And when you're writing blog posts for your website, you can just download Yoast SEO plugin and make sure that your blog posts are highly SEO optimized, readable, and generally you have good meta description, titles, keywords, etc. By the way, our WP Globe team can help you to generate high quality blog posts and YouTube videos. So if you want to know more about it, contact us, the link is in the description down below. Your fifth step will be, or tip, will be to build landing pages. Landing pages can be extremely helpful because those are just one pages that present your product in the most accurate, quick and engaging manner. Let's say very catching. And we have an article actually how to build good landing pages. I will leave the link down below. Make sure to check it out. Tip or step number six on the promotion of your WordPress plugin is to outreach professional bloggers who can do review for your plugin. Search YouTube, try to find people that have audience, contact them and agree on terms of collaboration. They can do video review about your plugin, therefore increase the trust factors of the users towards you. Tip number seven is to make sure that other blogs uh, include you in their listing articles. For example, best plugins or top five plugins that do this or that. Contact blogs, make sure they include you in their listings because it drives crazy amount of sales and conversions. For example, in our WP Globe, we write a lot of listing articles and we can include you in our listing. If you want that, again, check out the description down below. You can find out how to do that. Tip number eight is influencer marketing. Find influencers in your niche. And for example, again, if it's a gallery plugin, the person does not have to do video reviews about WordPress. You can find an influencer who is specializing in graphic design or any other form of visual communication and tell them about your product, agree on terms of collaboration, and then they can present your product, for example, and do a how-to tutorial, how to easily create a great looking designer portfolio with your product, which will again increase the trust factor and drive more sales. Tip number nine, do social sharing. Very easy, extremely easy nowadays. Share about your product in social media, especially useful for WordPress products. Those will be Facebook, LinkedIn and Twitter, because there you can find a huge communities of people interested in WordPress and plugins, etc. You can even post in the groups. Use signatures for your emails, your step number 10 or tip number 10. Take it or leave it, but email signatures really do help. No matter what email you're writing, if you're using a signature where you give a link to your product, website or whatever, people, some people tend to click on it to check it out. And generally, it is not hard to do, but it improves your chances of getting more traffic to your website, more visibility for your product and brand awareness. Use newsletters. Newsletters are amazing and this is your tip number 11. When you use newsletters, you can share product updates, new features, bugs fixed or whatever you want connected to your product to the users to remind them, hey, I do exist and now I offer this, therefore create more interest towards your product. Another step and tip to promote your plugin on WordPress is to build an affiliate program, basically. Some people, when you have already a customer base, you can offer them affiliate programs so that they will basically bring in new clients and get percentage from the sales. 
This will drive their motivation to share your product and bring new clients and it will just bring in new clients, which is quite logical and which is basically the whole purpose of this step. Another tip is to publish guest posts. It is very important to have your blog to publish there, but again, maybe your blog, blog especially at the start, did not reach like DA of 50 or above, so your posts will not rank at the first page of Google, therefore it will be harder to find them. But you can do guest posts on the blogs that offer that opportunity and on the blogs that already have a good DA. Offer plugin support. This can be extremely helpful. Yes, you need a bit more time, effort and team to offer plugin support. And if those are the developers of the plugin, this would be great. Because when users have questions related to your plugin and you answer them fastly, you help them to resolve the issues, answer their questions, you create a positive image for your product. So guys, this was all the methods I wanted to tell you about in this video. I hope you liked it and if you did, do not forget to share it with your friends and colleagues who may be interested in this topic. Also, please remember that success is all about consistency. If you want to be successful, you have to be consistent, you have to take necessary steps and do not expect results right away. But you are going to make it. See you in the next video. Bye!